Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today I have Kumi Curator. This is how you make a bracelet. Well, there's different ways how you make a bracelet. But this is how I'm gonna be making a bracelet today. So before we get started making these bracelets, don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any videos that I post. And let's start. First thing I'm going to talk about the inside. So this contains one cool maker of Kumi Creator. 60 spools, 7 clasps, 14 end caps, 2 tassel charms, 2 tassel bases, 2 clasp sticker sheets, 2 design booklets, 1 bracelet, measuring guide, and 1 playbook. And now, I think there's seven different colors here. Can't really see, but there's another one here. Now, let's open it. All right, I got the tape bottle. I think I opened this this way. Ta-da! <laughs> so there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven strings. Different color strings. Let's put that out. I'm gonna take everything out first. Look how thick this is. I thought I broke it. Here's the booklet with all the pages inside. Like all those pages. And we're on the first step, so we're gonna be here. First step is to attach the purple arm to the base. So this here. Or, yeah, like this. So I'm gonna do that. Is that good? Second one is lift the white tab up. It's already up. Step three is to push the, push the white arm down with one finger. One finger. Oh, it's. <laughs> Don't mind that. Anyway, let's flip this down and push it. It's good. Fourth step is to turn the handle clockwise. <laughs> no jump scares, please. It has to go in the blue spot. I see some blue here, so I'm gonna put this blue matched up with that blue spot. Ooh, we'll see it. See that blue spot? No! Okay. Oh no, it's not lined up. It's not lined up. Finally. Stage two, we passed stage one. Now stage, stage two, if we're gonna make bracelets we're gonna use the white spools this one we're gonna make necklaces black spools i'm gonna be making bracelets for now so i'm gonna take out the white spools all right let's just pop this out first let's white spools only i got one so far but let me see Hold the spool with a string and facing out. Do not unravel the string. And I have to put this in here, or one of these. I'm gonna do it this one. Don't pop out. There we go, clicked. There it is. So I'm gonna take this, unravel a little, or try to pull it up here. Aim with big fingers. <laughs> There you go. Now I'm gonna slide it through this purple thing. And then slide it here. If I can. And make sure this part of the string is not wiggly. And make sure it's tight. So there's kind of like a color theme you have to follow or not. But I'm gonna follow it. So I got this correct over here. So now I'm gonna pick my colors that I'm gonna use. So we have light pink, one hot pink, uh, 
and purple. Can get out. There you go. That's it. And also one white. We got it. Now I'm gonna put it in the pattern. It's hard. There you go. Another one here. And pop this here. Pop it. And purple. Last one. Alright. Now I have to take a little string out and connect it. I have two more left. Doing the second one. One more. So I reorganized it. So they're all tight. They're all tight, and now it's time to be spinning this. But first, I'm gonna close it. The flex. There you go. And I'll see red lines, and it tells me when to stop. So let's get start spinning. Ooh, look at it. It's getting bigger. <laughs> it's getting taller. Look. You see that bracelet? It's getting higher. Looking for the red line. Look at it. I forgot we were doing a bracelet. All right, necklace. different designs oh <laughs> and this is the wish bracelet it looks very pretty here pink purple hot pink white blue it's all the colors we used and there's a lot more we're on the bracelet book. there's fabulous squad party friendship and wish what we did and now, time to measure my wrist and tie the bracelet on. First, I'll put the sticker, then measure my wrist. So I'm gonna put it really tight over here. This is hard. All right. I didn't say anything. Wait, 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 Go back, show it, show it, show it, show it. So I measured my wrist and it was two and then down two. I'm going to measure the sticker right here. Probably like half of three, just in case. Right there. So I measured it. It's right here. So now I'll put that away and wrap this around. <laughs> so I'm gonna pull this white tab back and take out the string here. Got it. And now I take everything out here. So I got purple, blue, pink, more pink, more pink, more pink, more pink, and white. I'm gonna take this out. Ta-da! Now 
time to tie it. So now I'm gonna cut the extra tips. Haircuts. Nice and fuzzy. Now I have to cut the other end. I cut off the ends and now I have to look for a class. We will use not the rose gold one. We're gonna use the silver one because the rose gold one is for the necklace, and the metal or silver one is for the bracelet. Also, you need the end caps. The blue end caps are for the bracelet, and the black end caps are for the necklace. How much do we need? Whoopsie, I got the wrong one. This is the tassel and this is the clasp. I'm going to put this end, oh, I'm going to put this end in here. Here, I'm going to put this cap over here. There it goes. And I can't make it go down. So I'm going to put this in the other end and connect it. All right, put that in. Now, lock. There we go. Oh my gosh, that's really small. Let's see, I'm trying to slide it down my. Ta da! This is the wish bracelet. It's really pretty, and I'll wear it. <laughs> And I'm going to be cleaning this up and start a necklace. For the necklace, I'm going to do the radiant one, the blue one. And I'm going to set this up first. So, and I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven blues and one purple. It is, I could buy yarn and just attach it on here. Anyways, let's this in. Time to spin. Now spin. Now spin. So I do not. We're gonna go fast. Last time we did slow, now we're going fast. Also, do you like my nails? <laughs> So here it is. It's really simple and not like this one. Colorful. I only see a little purple on it, but mostly blue. So what am I gonna do? You might ask. Because it might be a bracelet. We can make this into a necklace. So like always I'm gonna put a sticker right here. Right. Squish it. It's not really tight. We're not going to put it down here because that's how you make a bracelet. So we're going to unclip it and take this out. So I'm going to put this down like this and then put it out because I'm going to put it here. And then now I'm going to put it in this area. And now it's stuck. And now we're going to turn this so it could become longer. Back to work. There we go. Done. I'm gonna put the sticker down here. Here. Then tie it around. And done. Now I'm gonna remove these. I am taking out the rest of the string or yarn. Out the spools. So I could trim it. Maybe I could use the extra for another one, but it won't be enough. So now I'm going to take the whole necklace out. That, ooh. Mm. Anyway, I'm going to cut it here. I am done. And now I'm going to make the tassel. 
This is the materials I need for my tassel. So what you're going to do is you're going to take each strings and overlap it in the slots. Like, keep on going, different strings. So then, once you're done with that and they're all half, like, you're gonna trim it so it won't be really long. So, for this, you can put two strings per slot. And here it is, just finished for now. And I'm gonna trim it so it could be the right size. Ta da! Should I cut this, cut my hair this short? Now let's pull this through. I'm gonna connect these now. I'm gonna take this part. This is the rose gold, because this is, rose gold is for necklaces. The silver one is for the bracelets. And the cup is black. That's for the necklaces, and the blue one is for the bracelets. So here it is. Here's the bracelet. And here's the necklace. I really like how this turned out. I could wear it, could detach it and connect it. I really like this design and I really like the bracelet too. They don't really match because this one doesn't really have color, that much color. This one is a lot of color. And thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, turn on post notifications so you don't miss any videos that I post. What else? <laughs> Follow my Instagram and my TikTok. My TikTok name is Demi Adriana19. Same as my Instagram. So love you guys so much. Bye.